obviously is like he ever sent me this whole oh one. So hopefully <laughs> you guys will see me better in this video. I'm sorry, I'm right behind the light. Bad idea. So I'm don't worry, I'll delete that in a video. I'm gonna talk about my trusty pendulum. It's my favorite um Kaiser's eye. I'm gonna try to do it again. So um it comes with uh, a little bead at the end, Tyson's eye bead. And I put a little charm on it. Just gotta kind of touch, you know. And uh, it's this long. Or if it's too long, you can just wrap it around. I like to wrap it around like that because I usually have my arm close to me. And then uh, I have my other hand underneath the pendulum. That's where you can really feel its force. And, uh, or something manipulating it. You can use this pendulum for like, um, definition, spirit, communication, in my case, <coughs> definition. Sorry, I'm just getting over a cold. Hold on. I'm gonna bring you more in depth. What is a pendulum? I'm sure both of y'all have heard about pendulum. But to me, it is a pendulum. Ugh. The pendulum is a weight uh, suspended from the pivot that has, you know, swing freely. That's what it's supposed to be freely on its own. See? When a pendulum is displaced sideways from its resting position, um, it is subject to its restoring force the gravity that will accelerate back toward that original position, right? So mainly you can um you can ask yes or no questions and um personal questions, guidance this is good for guidance too. Or like, you know, will I get this job or will I get this get time to buy a car? Well I win the lottery. <laughs> but first you need to train your Pendulum, right? Um, so you, a lot of ways you just ask, show me yes. It's one like this. So yes, or thank you. Show me no. One like this. <laughs> there you go. Show me, I don't know. I don't know if I, okay. And how I train my you know, a lot of people train their pendulums differently now. And their yes should be this way. And their no should should be this way, you know. And their yes should be other way. But it all depends on you. So worth what's best for you. And this is my favorite, like I say, Kaiser's eye. There are many crystals you can work with, chakras, um, whatever you want, healing you know, whatever, countless. Um, so I have a couple of readings that I bought from groups, uh, if you ever want me to ask a question for you, let me know, but it has to be precise, yes or no questions, right? So, um, if I remember correctly, um, from one of the people in the, my spirit chaser group, or my medium, my whole group, uh, it's good to write it down too. <laughs> Um, I believe it's from here. Hey, here. Um, she wants to know if there are spirits, particular spirits in her room, in her apartment. Yeah, in her apartment. Um, she asked specifically that, and also if the spirit is. Okay, let's ask that first. Chandelier, is there spirits in Carol's apartment? Yes, see? Right, you can ask your pendulum twice. Pendulum, is there spirits in Carol's apartment? And you can also feel it, sense it, hear it. In my case, I can do all a little bit of both. <laughs> if you're a medium, it does help. And sometimes you never know, you might get extra messages. And uh, I'm using my tablet to record this, so I'm not using the angle and this camera. So, okay, there are. Now, she wants to know if there are specific 
two spirits in her apartment, is that right, Pendon? Is there two spirits in her apartment? Try to hold it all on as steady as possible. Thank you. Is this one particular spirit? Is this an older female? Is there an older female? And a younger female. Is there a younger female? There you go, Carol. No, that's Carol reading. No, there you go. And you hit it. You hit tap. Tap, tap, tap. Tap, tap, tap. Get ready for that pretty. And, um. I get one more question I can ask. This is for Lisa. Hey, Lisa. She wants to know. Does her spirits like it when she uses the uh, ITC apps? Ooh, I feel an energy. That means yes. When I feel energy right away, either from my mouth or lips, whatever, from my hand, <sighs> there's something there. Don't you tell Lisa that's a yes? So, there, so her spirits like it when Lisa uses the ITC apps? Oh, that's a big yes. Sometimes it's a big yes. <laughs> Thank you. And then you can end it with tap, tap, tap. There you go. So I hope you guys enjoyed my short mini panel of readings. And um, I don't know when I'll be able to do live here in my group. So if you guys can hit the magic bell and also the magic like button. Who knows, I'll come back to do more of these fun readings for you guys. And, um, so yeah. So, thank you all for watching. We should hold that for one one out. <laughs>